Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you're returning, thank you so much for subscribing. In this video, I'm going to be reviewing the Supergoop sunscreen stick. And this is the Supergoop Play SPF 50. It is water resistant for 80 minutes and it has zinc oxide and that is it in here. The sunscreen only comes in one color and so if you have skin tone that is my skin tone or darker, there will be a white cast on your skin. The only thing is that it is definitely not made for normal combination or oily skin because the finish of the sunscreen is very oily. It's definitely geared towards a drier skin. It does blend really well onto the skin. It doesn't have any pills at all. If you're looking for a non-tinted sunscreen stick that is a little bit less oily than this sunscreen stick, this is the Sum sunscreen stick. I'm just going to remove some of the oil here. And this sunscreen doesn't have any color and it doesn't have a white cast on your skin. It is a little bit drier so it's definitely more suitable for oily skin. This sunscreen is SPF 50, it is PA++++ and it's a Korean brand and it does have fragrant in here. Now a sunscreen stick that I have really been enjoying lately is from B Beauty and this is a tinted mineral sunscreen stick. It is water resistant for 80 minutes and it comes in 3 different colors and I have here in the color latte. And this sunscreen has nano zinc oxide in here. The sunscreen also blends really really well and it's not too oily and it's not too matte. I absolutely have been really enjoying the sunscreen lately. Now if you want both titanium dioxide and zinc oxide in the sunscreen stick, this is the Headhunter Surfscreen SPF 45. Just going to remove some of the sunscreen here. It is also water resistant for 80 minutes and it also comes in 3 different colors. I have here in the color Premium Light Brown. Now I really enjoyed the sunscreen for a minute here but there's something about the titanium. Sometimes a titanium dioxide can cause a breakout for me and this sunscreen definitely broke me out. So I don't use this sunscreen anymore but it's also a really good option if your skin can tolerate the titanium dioxide. So if you have dry sensitive skin and your skin tone is lighter than mine then you may enjoy this sunscreen. Also check out my other sunscreen videos. I'm working on a best um, water resistant sunscreen video right now so i have been taking some time off and so thank you so much for stopping by and i will see you next time bye